What age should you stop having sex? Well, the word stop is very interesting. Yeah! <laughs> I've been sexually active approximately a little more than 50 years. I started becoming sexually active around the age of 18. Been doing it ever since. <laughs> uh, so that would make me almost 42 years, my God. Uh, that's a long time. Generally, there should be no need to stop right. unless there's no longer a desire. You start off as two individuals who blend into one. You create something greater than yourselves, but at some point you're back to that connection. Mm -hmm. And that's when it should get even more special. Things start to slow down. Things don't work as good as they used to. But stopping, that's not in my vocabulary. Yeah, well, when they don't work the way they're supposed to. Technology has come a very long way. And there are many, many other options to help things along. There are couples who like to um, insert toys into their playtime. Anything goes, as long as the two yeah, people it, are, are comfortable exactly. with that. Exactly. If it makes you happy, go for it. I agree. I agree. Uh, oh, you're giving it to me? Yeah, I don't know. You can try to figure this out. L Lilo? It yeah, almost looks like a cactus, you know? But we have foreplay 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I still have... I still have a shower with my wife every day. And it's not just scrubbing up. You could take that home. I got one like that in the house. Do you? Yes, I do. Wow. I think my wife would love it. At this point in time, we need help. And so he uses those sweet little blue pills. And I use any number of different lubricants. Uh, I, I'm really interested in this lust, lust duster. Dust. A woman tends to lose her lubricancy. Yes. And these products enhance, they are lubricants and they enhance the feelings that you get internally. So therefore you can enjoy the process better. This is called Sensual Sampler. They have the Lust Dust. Smooch me. Ooh, oh, I love these that. titles. That's so cute. Smooch me. Ignite me. That sounds good. Yeah, that's right. Devour me. Okay, Ooh, this one. Oh, what do you call you? No, you, you, yeah, you put it on put it your on. body and, and then it, it's the edible. Uh, yeah, yeah. Edible. That the question is, what are you eating? Never mind. <laughs> that's for another program. And this one says, rub me. Rub me, touch me, devour yeah, me. Yeah, that one says, rub me. Something for all hours of the day and night. I could just picture the satin sheets and you fall right off the bed. That's <laughs> hysterical. OK. Please, Please yeah, gel. there's a whole. Yes. Group of them here, liquid, cream. There's a liquid, a cream, and a gel for please. Cool. cool. Can I keep this? And Can I take this home with I me? I want to take some home for my wife. You want to share? We'll split it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. At our age, you need to plan it out. We have to plan, out. yes. yes. I, want that on, I want that on record. You need to plan it out. You need to plan it, plan it out. So I know when he's taking a pill, I know when to use the lubricant That's so right. that we meet at the right time together. Yeah. Don't believe everything you hear on television. Exactly. Take it from us because we're experienced. Absolutely. You know, sometimes sex works out well. Sometimes it works out even better. And when it works out even better, we're, my husband and I sit there and laugh and go, that was pretty good. And at our age, we're lucky we didn't have a heart attack. You know, and remember, but we're proud of ourselves for having the energy and the enthusiasm and the desire to do that kind of thing. And I wish that for everybody at this age. And remember, if you're not going to have intercourse, there's other things you can do. Even at our age and beyond. Okay. Right. The equipment is, it may not work as good as it used to, but it still works. We're just happy that we can get up in the morning every day and have the ability to go out and do what we have to do and take care of business and at the end of the day be able to come home to someone who we've loved for as long as we have and still be able to have a good sex life uh, with our significant other and that's really it in a nutshell. I've been with my husband 
almost 50 years. And I, I would not look to have sex with anyone else. Might try one of those toys for yeah. myself. However, that's a whole other story. If I was in that situation, I would probably be out there looking to find a girlfriend pretty quick so that I could go back and have sex. And I'd like to share them with someone. It's more about the idea that you want to be with someone. Not necessarily be in bed with them, but just be with them. Somebody to talk to, somebody to relate to, somebody to share experiences with uh, every day of, for the remaining days that you have on this earth. Okay, so this is soft, and then maybe if we took like, this is like our, this part right here. So I'll give it maybe a good two and a half inches. <laughs>